of the frame. Oh, come on. Cheap shot. Oh, great. Now all of a sudden Viscera is getting stronger. I don't know how this is happening. Ah, move. Move out of the way. Okay, go. Okay, go. Get up. Get up, you fool. Come on. Oh, come on. This is ridiculous. Oh, no. Ah. Oh. Jesus Christ. I'm dead. Can't get out of the way. I can't get out of the way. Doing everything I can. I cannot get out of his way. Oh. Oh, no. I think I'm dead. I'm dead. Oh, no. I tried. Oh, no. Power bomb. Big Daddy V power bomb. But he's got to make me bleed. That's the thing. Unless he makes me bleed, it's not going to happen. And how do I get him to bleed? I don't know. Oh, come on. Don't, don't start this rubbish again. Now, all of a sudden, Viscera has become stronger than me. Oh, come on. I don't believe that for a second. That's BS. This game's broken. But he's got to make me bleed. If he can't do that, then... Oh. Do you know what? I've just had enough. This is just unfair. Like, do all the specials on me you want, but it's not going to make a difference. I have to let, it get him, let him get it out of his system. Oh, we could be here for a while, guys. I, I apologise. I have no friggin' idea how to make him bleed. Anymore. I used to be able to do it. No problem, but here it's just... It doesn't seem to want to work. Okay, I need to move out of the way. Okay, fire extinguisher. Just took the fire extinguisher at him. Okay, gotta punish him. Oh, come on. Oh, Jesus wept. Oh, I've got to make this guy bleed. How do I do it? Oh, I don't think I can do it in this room. I think I need to just get him somewhere else and try it. Move. Oh. He's one tough home break. Oh my god. He's just beating me to death now with, with the fire extinguisher. Okay. Oh, come on. Will you just give me one? Just give me one. Jesus Christ. I just want one. That's all I want. I can't. Oh. The game's just not letting me freaking win anymore. It's, it's, it's impossible. How is this... Okay, I'll try again. Come on. Okay. Oh. This has reversed it. He's just reversing everything that I do now all of a sudden. So I've no idea how to make this guy bleed. Because it's not working. Oh. I suppose one advantage is he can't pin me. He has to make me bleed. So that's one thing he's got going for him. Oh, he's missed me. Somehow he's missed me. I've caught it. How do I make this guy bleed? God, this is a brutal match for the hardcore title.
Oh shit, man. Say what you want about Nelson Fraser, but my god, in this game, he is one tough mofo. Oh my god, this match is just rolling on and on. And I've got to put him away, I'm doing everything I can and nothing's working. And I don't know what to, what else to do. Okay. It's not working. Surely hitting him with something would make him bleed. Oh my god, that didn't work at all. Don't know why I bother. Let's try this. Oh, now my energy's going up. Now we're talking. Okay. Move. Move. Come on. Why won't this make him bleed? I don't get it. How do I make him bleed? Is the question. I had this problem with the friggin' ladder match. I couldn't do the ladder match. Now all of a sudden I can't make him bleed. Ridiculous. I don't know what else to do. Alright. Fair enough. I'm gonna get him from behind. I'm just gonna do the special from behind. Right. Gonna do another one. More effective than the mandible claw. It just does not freaking work at all. This I don't know what I'm supposed to do. There you are. I managed to get a special on him, even as the attitude meter ended. So, yay me, I guess. The three finishing moves I've got on him so far. Come on, do something. Oh, I'm so fed up. Yeah, sometimes I think this game's broken. It just doesn't seem to do what you want it to do. This match has been going 12 minutes now, and I still haven't made this guy bleed. I don't know. I'm going to have to take him into a different room, I think, because nothing I do is working. Pick it up. Okay, come on. Go. Alright, we need to leave this room. I think we need to go into the uh, bar area, maybe. And get him up here. There's a kendo stick. Is that a kendo stick or is that oh, it's a baseball bat? Okay. Come on, Biss. Alright. Biss, this right? you need to stop hitting me now. You need to stop so I can get us in this room. I'm panicking now. No! Oh, for God's sake. I don't want I don't I don't want to be back on the stage. I want to be back. I need to the only way to do it is to is to be in one of these rooms. Well, he reversed me into here, so that's what that's something I guess. And check it out the weapons of um, respawn, so that's something. Okay, so I'm trying to get him in one of these rooms. No! Oh. Oh, for Christ's sake, I am fed up. I've never been more fed up than I have. I'm doing everything I can, and I just can't make him bleed. And he's always getting the upper hand, so I can't do anything. Oh, for Christ's sake, just give me a break. See, why is he reversing everything that I do? Why can't I get something in on him? That's just not fair. It ain't right. Come on. Stupid. <sighs> Doing everything I can. The viscera is just. He's too tough. I don't know how I'm going to beat him. This is going to be a Herculean task. I'm like, as I said, I had this problem with the freaking ladder match where I didn't know what to do, and now the same thing's happening. I don't know what to do against him.
you've just got an answer for every little single thing that I do. Oh no, you don't, not this time. Oh, well at least he always whipped me in the right direction this time. Okay. Mandible claw. We're making bleed little stone down a little bit. I think I'm I'm in the room I want to be in. Come on, cactus, pick him up, please. Thank you. Right, let's Irish whip him in this room. This should be the bar now. Right. Okay. We're in the bar now. Come on over here. There's a dartboard over here, so maybe that will make him bleed. Okay. This might do it. I know this worked in previous videos. Yeah, I've done it. I've made him bleed. I've won. There you go. Holy crap. Can you believe that guy's nearly 16 minutes it took me to beat Viscera? And all because he wouldn't bleed. So, that was ridiculous. So you have to take him into the bar and then use darts on him, essentially, to make him bleed. But I've won the match anyway, so that's done. Oh Jesus, that took a long time, but I've done it anyway, and I've moved on to chapter 8 now. Oh my God. Alright, defending match part 2, here we go guys. Right, so, here comes Vince McMahon. So what you got to say? The current situation of Hardcore Championship is chaos, so I've made a decision. Tonight in this very ring there will be a fatal 4-way match to determine who the Hardcore Champion is. Okay. So it's, it could be an elimination style match basically. Hardcore 4 way championship match. Only requirement to clear this match is to win. So it's me, Ball Buchanan, Nessa Rios and Viscera. Apologies it's taken me so long guys. But that first blood match was an absolute joke. But check it out. I love that little hardcore championship thing. Little logo there. Which was so authentic back in the day. I don't know why I'm struggling over my words today. What's going on? And since when did SA Rios become a contender? That's what I don't understand. Alright, let's do this. Is this going to be an elimination match? Yes, it is. So basically, I don't really have to do anything. Um, as long as they eliminate each other, I should be alright. Oh, come on. Cheap shot. Again, just had it up to here with bloody viscera. That's the problem. I'm fed up of having to fight him every five bloody minutes. I'd say he's very tough though. The match may have been long, but my god, it was could have gone either way. I was legitimately worried for a minute because I thought he was going to beat me. It's like the guy just would not bleed, no matter what I did to him. Pick it up, pick it up, cactus. Might as well take Viscera out of contention straight away because he's the most dangerous. So I'll just try and pin him if I can. Buchanan and SA can fight it out and then I'll pick up the, the bones of them later on. Oh my god. This just goes on and on and on. And bloody Ariston. Okay, come on. Do it. There we go. Yes. Get up Viscera. I think I've got him this time. Yeah, reversed it. Okay. Right. He's not doing anything now, so let's put the mandible claw on him. And we'll take away his energy. SA Rios is actually doing quite well against Buchanan, so I guess he's more agile. 
Okay, right, let's try and pin this over. Okay, it's not working. So I guess I've got to pin him in the ring then. What's the point of that if it's a hardcore match and you can't pin him anywhere else except in the ring? Makes no sense. Oh well. I'll try and pin him here. Oh, actually, yes, has got the pin. Move. Oh, I couldn't move out of the way. Alright, here we go. Gonna pin. I've got it. Oh my god, no. Viscera kicked out. Christ, man. This is the sort of game that's just hardcore to the bone, essentially. It's like. You have to work so hard on this division. I'm surprised, really, how much effort has gone into it. I need to put this away because this is getting ridiculous now. Alright, let's pin this Oh, what? He's oh, what load of rubbish. He's nowhere near the ropes. Come on. Alright, let's pick up this This should do it now. I need to eliminate him because this is getting silly now. There we go, so this was gone. So now. Okay, put the mandible claw on Ball Buchanan. And look at that. I've got the full impact of the move, even though SA uh, tried to kick me. Pull it on SA Rios now. Drain his energy a little bit. I love it. Oh, bugger. Move. Punish him a little bit just to make sure he doesn't kick out. Okay, we'll just try and pin him now. Hopefully. There you go, it's me and SA Rios now. And look at that, I've already. <laughs> look at that, I had an insult to injury. Buchanan hasn't even been able to get up, and I've just whacked him again. Now he's rolling outside the ring. There we go. Okay, come on, get in the ring. Come on, SA. Mandible claw, mandible claw. We've almost got this, guys. We've almost got this. Get up, get up, get up, get up. Oh! Little bugger, have a clothesline, right. This should do it now, I think I've done it now. One, two, oh my god, S.A. Rios is still alive, can you believe it? S.A. Rios is still friggin' alive. I like, as I said, I admire the fact, his tenacity, but he's just not gonna win this, it's just not gonna happen. Sorry, S.A., the hardcore title is not gonna be in your future. This is probably the closest you're ever gonna get to it, my friend. You have to be careful because the wrestlers outside can still interfere in the match and still ham hamper your progress, so stay away from them if you can. That's the best advice, and just stay inside the ring. They can't come back in, but they can make life difficult for you if you decide to leave the ring and you get close up to them. Okay, I'm just going to pin him now, this should do it. Okay, here I just do this, come on. Two. And there we go. 
So I've done it. Nice. I like it. Fantastic. So there you go, guys. I've done it. Retain the hardcore title. That was tough, man. That was really, really tough. I don't mind saying. Um, that first blood match. Wow. It was definitely a hard-fought victory. I wasn't sure I was actually going to make him bleed. Nothing was working until I took him into the bar and I hit him on the dartboard. Here's the new hardcore champion, Cactus. Please welcome the champion. Congratulations, Cactus. Thank you for playing, but that was just the beginning. Good luck. Okay. Okay. As I say, congratulations, you've become the hardcore champion, but there will be more obstacles for you to remain the true champion. You'll be the people's champion only when you complete all the paths to the end. Enjoy playing the other courses and good luck. Okay, here we go. Look at that, 149 grand. I've earned so far in playing this game. And we get the credit sequence as well. So yeah, apologies guys, I did stumble over my words a little bit. Um, I just can't believe this division, to be honest. Um, the match with Viscera, oh my god. I just can't believe I was able to pull off a victory there. Uh, he just wasn't bleeding no matter what I did. I think there's some sort of glitch in this game or something. Because, like... All the damage I was doing to him, he should have bled. But as I said, you have to like hit him and hit him and hit him. Work out what to do and then like take him into the bar. Use the dartboard. That seems to draw blood a lot quicker. I should have done that straight away to be fair. And I was thinking about that. But I was also thinking, well, that can't be the only way to make him bleed. It's a bit ridiculous if, if that's all you've got to rely on. Or it could be that because Viscera is like a, a, a stocky wrestler that... It's, it's harder for him to actually draw blood, I don't know. So it's a complete mystery. But I tell you what, this has been a fantastic, um, for me anyway, fantastic fun uh, Let's Play. Um, lots of twists and turns. We've unlocked more of the storylines as well. Um, I will have to follow this up next time and then make a different decision um, going into it. So I need to go through again and then lose at a certain point and then take me back down the path. I think so. That's what I'll do. Anyway, all that's left to say is thank you very much. This has been Lucas Macintosh. Thank you so much for taking the time to check out one of my retro Let's Play videos. I really appreciate it. If you are indeed enjoying my content and want to see more than one, I hit that subscribe button because what it means for you lovely people is you will be instantly subscribed to my channel and notified every time I upload a new video and I've got new content coming each and every single week. Please don't forget to follow me on Twitter at Dodgers Game. I'm also on Tumblr, also at Dodgers Game, and I'm on Facebook as well. And you can find the link in this uh, video description or on my channel, Banner Artwork, as well. So, yeah, uh, tough, tough set of videos, but we're getting through it slowly but surely. This is a very, very long process, so I won't be doing this anytime soon personally you know um it's going to take me a while but i'm going to try and get through it as quickly as i can because i said i've been on this for months now um and it hasn't always been consistent i mean i've been doing bits when i can but obviously because it's come to christmas it's becoming harder and harder and stuff so to actually get some time away so yeah next time i'll go down that path try and stick to that path I think if I can because it's very confusing so I may have to pick someone else so I'm not sure who I'll who I'd really want to play as so I might pick Crash Holly or something just to give me a bit of extra challenge because he's like um, a lot more vulnerable even though he's quite tough he can be pinned quite easily so maybe that's something I could consider maybe him or just a um, a weaker wrestler or something and then once I've done this once I've got through the first lot sort of unlocked all the storylines from this side then I have to move to the next side uh, to the defending side and then um, do some work there and try and get rid of more of those gaps on the other side so that's something I can do mind you I have that option now I could easily go to the other side but it's kind of like I just want to kind of 
do everything as much as I can in the one area because then once it's done it's done and I won't have to go back and I won't kind of get confused so that's kind of my thinking anyway as I said I will get some more perfect dark films as well I'll probably be doing that tomorrow but I just thought I'd get a load of this done first uh, get it done uploaded edited and all that so I wonder how much of a percentage of the game I've got now it's got to be like 50 I wanna I'm gonna guess and say it's about 56 percent or something which isn't too bad but I could have done with um, unlocking more to be honest but as I said I didn't want to sort of reset my console too much because it's like you know, like, I can see how for people watching it, it could be a bit annoying, you know, but I just wanted to get as much unlocked as I could. And then I got to that point where I was like, oh my god, I've gone down the wrong path. So I remember now, it was chapter 6, I think, where I think I needed to change the storyline there. So I think I either needed to win or lose at that point in order to change it again. And then, um,. That should keep me down that narrow little path then. Because as I said, it's not a case of you see the straight path, you win, win, win all the time. Sometimes it'll just, it'll try and steer you off the path. So it's like trying to keep on it is very, very difficult. Right, so let's just get this. Thank you for Mick Foley. Then we will go and check it out and see how much we've unlocked. Thank you very much. You're welcome, Mick. Well, as I said, even though I found it a bit frustrating, I did really enjoy this. Uh, very, very challenging. So I really feel like I've I've done quite well. Let's have a look. 55%, so not too bad. So I'll be going into that division next time and then going down that path and try and get those uh, remaining gaps on that one side. So thank you very much, guys. Remember to wrap up warm, have a nice cup of tea, and I will see you next time for some WWF No Mercy from Nintendo 64. I'll see you soon.